Russia threatens Western leaders, they won't be able to hide on Capitol Hill or in the Elysee Palace. The deployment of Western troops to Ukraine would be akin to these countries declaring war on Russia and lead to a catastrophe on a global scale, Russian Security Council Deputy Chairman Dmitry Medvedev said. Sending their troops to the territory of former Ukraine will mean their direct involvement in the war. We will have to respond to this and, alas, not on the territory of former Ukraine, he wrote on his Telegram channel. He added that in this case, Western leaders won't be able to hide on Capitol Hill or in the Elysee Palace or on 10 Downing Street. A global catastrophe will ensue, Medvedev concluded. According to him, the cause of the discussion on dispatching Western troops to Ukraine, launched by French President Emmanuel Macron, is a shameless calculation for political bonus points. Some kind of a total degradation of the ruling class in the West is underway. Medvedev clarified and reiterated that the extent of the catastrophic nature of such a clash was something US President John Kennedy and Russian leader Nikita Khrushchev could grasp over 60 years ago. Yet, current immature imbeciles who got to power in the West keep failing to recognize this, he added. Following these threats, it is noteworthy that Russian President Vladimir Putin has ordered tactical nuclear weapons drills in response to what the Defense Ministry has described as provocative statements and threats from the West. Moscow will carry out the drills in the near future to increase the readiness of non-strategic nuclear forces to perform combat missions, the Defense Ministry said in a statement, noting that they will be held with Russian formations from the Russian Southern Military District and Russian Navy forces. During the exercise, a set of measures will be carried out to practice the issues of preparation and use of non-strategic nuclear weapons, the Defense Ministry said. The exercises are aimed at maintaining the readiness of personnel and equipment of units for the combat use of non-strategic nuclear weapons and ensuring the nation's territorial integrity and sovereignty in response to provocation statements and threats by individual Western officials against the Russian Federation, the ministry added. At least six people have been shot at an apartment complex in Fort Worth, Texas, police reported. The ages of the victims range from 3 to 19. The incident took place on Wednesday evening at an apartment complex in the 3000 block of Las Vegas Trail in the western part of the city. According to the Fort Worth Police Department early Thursday morning, a total of six victims received injuries ranging from minor to severe. Police received a call about a reported shooting at an apartment complex at around 7.30 p.m., when they arrived at approximately 7.38 p.m., officers located several victims with gunshot wounds outside in the parking lot, police said. Five of the victims were hospitalized while one refused treatment for their injury, the police said, adding that the conditions of the five who were taken in for medical care are currently unknown. Making a statement regarding the shooting incident, the authority said that the Fort Worth Police Department can confirm that a suspect vehicle was observed driving by this location and at least one or more individuals shot from the suspect vehicle toward all of the victims at the location. The investigation into the shooting remains open and officers are gathering information and attempting to locate the suspect vehicle and suspect or suspects.